everyone, my name's Maya and I'm a zookeeper at the Fresno Chaffee Zoo and I'm hanging out today with Xena, who is an ornate box turtle. Now box turtles get their name because they are actually the only type of turtle that is able to fully pull themselves into their shells and close that shell to protect themselves from predators. So if you look at the bottom of Xena's plastron here, that's the bottom part of her shell, you will see that she has this hinge that enables her to fully close up if she were to feel threatened by predators. She would pull her arms and her legs and her head and even her tail all the way into that shell and that's a really hard surface that's going to be very difficult for all but the strongest predators to be able to open. Now you might notice that she has these really long nails. Those nails tell you a little bit about how she spends her life. She uses them to dig for different types of vegetation and invertebrates that she might want to eat. Box turtles are considered near threatened, and that is mostly due to habitat loss. They are found on the Great Plains, and whenever there is construction and development, that can impact box turtle habitat. So it is really important that we make sure that we preserve that habitat for these guys. Box turtles are considered near threatened, so that means that they are in danger of potentially going extinct in the future if their habitat is not protected. It is important to balance the needs of the people who are trying to find places to live with the needs of the animals who call that their natural habitat. Now you might notice that Xena has these really bright orange eyes. The males actually have dark red eyes, and that's one way you can tell the difference between male and female box turtles. Thanks for joining us, and we'll be back with lots of other great animals from the Fresno Chappie Zoo.